guys, looks like it's recording. Need a doodle here. I had to re-record this because something popped up on my screen that isn't very good. Uh, there's a message that isn't really for, ch for children's eyes, or really anyone's eyes, I guess. Um, I just want to talk about why I'm playing Clicker here. It's just uh, to fill up time right now while I talk during this video. Just a little uh, addictive game, I guess so. Um, but I want to talk about, I think I'm going to branch off from Terraria and play TF2 or something. I want to play Dota, but since I don't know how to edit very well, I'd have to edit on a lot of bad words because there's so many salty people in the game, and it's not worth the time. So I'm thinking right now about Team Fortress 2, or maybe a Subnautica playthrough. I love Subnautica. Little bit scary. That's alright. Um... Let's see here. Also, the thing is, like, why I quit Terraria is because, um, I'm not sure if I already said this, because I literally just had to record this and then delete it, because, obviously, one of my friends sent me a weird message. Um, I spent the whole day to preparing for, um, Wall of Flesh, literally gathering stars. I get, like, ten a night, because I have a good star catcher. Not that good, but it takes a while, as you can guess. And, um, basically it was taking me ages, you know, uh, it took a long, long time. And then when I finally do it, I figure out my platform is too high. And instead of, you know, most people probably would have just gone back, you know, oh, I'll build the platform again, that's okay. But it's like, for me it's not like that. The damage is kind of already done, and at that point I just kind of wanted to maybe put the series on hold so it's not forced content that makes sense. Because if I have forced content, I'll put off a vibe that isn't welcoming or friendly, I guess if that makes sense to any of you. More of a, he's putting his heart into this, he's enjoying this, versus he's kind of forcing himself to do this just for the sake of the series, not because he's enjoying it. I mean, before that point, I was enjoying it. Except when I kept wiping on Skeletron, that part pissed me off to no end. Like, I complain about it, I complain you needed to be nerfed, all this, all this business. But yeah, I was thinking about maybe a Subnautica playthrough, or like a, um, um, TF2. I can't do Dota because there's too many swear words, too many salty people, it's too much of a hassle to, um, to edit out, you know, it's, it's way too big of a hassle. Because there's so many swear words, it would just be like, based on my uh, editing prowess, it'd basically just be like a choppy video because I'd take out the wrong part or something. And, um, yeah, it would end up like that. So anyways, I hope you guys understand because I, uh, I, d I don't feel like playing Terraria after that. Because when the wall flesh spawned, I was trying to shoot him and his eyeballs were way below me. I even had like a build set up, I was using the necro armor and the mini shark, which is literally as you guys know only good for that boss. I mean in hard mode the mini shark becomes garbage, literally. I imagine a wooden sword is about on par with it, if not better. Because it literally does one or two damage to each um, enemy, as you know uh, they usually a low amount of health for them is like 200 or so, so imagine having to put in a hundred shots into someone if not 200 or anywhere in between there. I'm not saying I'll quit Terraria, it's just me when I'm like done with a game for a while. It's that I just don't feel comfortable playing it for a while, I'm kind of mad at the game. Like I still like Terraria, but I don't want to play it for a while. Hopefully everyone will understand that. That's okay. Till then, I'm not just going to be playing Clicker Heroes. I just thought it would be good to have something in the background. Um, well, I am narrated, I guess. Also, if you guys didn't know, all my videos are... I probably mentioned this before. ADHD. Um, it, all my videos are unscripted. And they're not like... I don't view ahead and then record. 
It's just, okay, I'm gonna record, let's go. I'm literally commentating it as it happens. It's not just, oh, I found a, um, I found a chest in here. Better turn on my recording software because they want to see this. It's completely unscripted. It's completely as I see it. It's like watching me play is like you were standing behind me. I just look behind me. So I was got scared. Um, and listening to me gripe and B word I won't mention about how unfair the game is. But um, in off camera I did build a um. It was basically an army destroyer. I copied it from a guy, I think his name is Happy Days or something. Uh, copied his build. It's basically kind of a pyramid so the mobs can get up and in but not out. And you put like a single layer of lava. And um, you can pick up other items and they're gold and stuff. Uh, despite it being in lava since you're so close to it. And none of the mobs can get to you bar goblin mages from goblin invasions. They're quite a nuisance because you have to deflect their shots, but it's... I mean, if you want to AFK it, they're your only worry. But it, assuming they're not present, you can literally just sit in there and make hard dash. Nothing will ever hit you. I mean, maybe one of those, uh, like, uh, slender pink worms will come after you. But who knows, those are, I don't think those can spawn in, um, normal, like, uh, areas, like where you spawn in the overworld and all that. That'll literally be your only concern, but that's still pretty far-fetched. Anyways. Yeah, I'm not sure what to talk about now. Hmm. I've been playing Click for Heroes a lot today after I watched another, uh, YouTuber play or Sips from the Ogscast play it. He was enjoying it himself. And now that I kind of understand the game a little bit better. I'm kind of enjoying it more. Just getting the abilities that are important, you know. It's important to max this girl out because she gives all your other heroes uh, damage. She's just a support character. That's cool. I remember getting very far in this game, and like it would, it wasn't fun at some point because like well obviously the game's been updated um immensely what do you say? um the game's been updated immensely you can even fight kappa the almighty kappa himself i'll go back and find him at some point maybe in another video but yeah maybe comment what you'd like to see me play next i will revisit terraria but i just don't want to force myself to play it because, um, I don't think I should create forced content, because otherwise you'll sense that, and I'll feel the uneasiness. We both will, viewer and producer me. Um, but yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna cut the video there, because I really haven't anything else to say. Hope you guys enjoyed it. <laughs>